Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2021 Topps Chrome Baseball. Four box, hobby box break, pick your team number one. Loose boxes right here, not from any particular case is how they appear to me. All card ship, big thanks everybody here for making it happen. And we got another four boxes in, this, uh, in the store right now too, jazbeescasebreaks.com. You can get your team's mic with that last spot mojo fillies. Thanks everybody. Matthew, what's going on man? Super Bowl predictions? A little early for Super Bowl predictions, isn't it? I might have a better better idea after the uh, wild card round. Otherwise, uh, otherwise it's definitely Raiders from the AFC playing the playing the Eagles. Nick Jaspi, Jason Jaspi are big fans of the Eagles. I'm a Raiders guy. Raiders Eagle Super Bowl would be awesome. They'll be here in SoFi. You definitely take that day off. Be awesome. Matthew likes uh, Bills Cowboys. Yeah, I don't know what the I have no idea what the Cowboys are about. I feel like you know I feel like they're just they looked really good early on, and they are kind of inconsistent later on. Who are the Who are the real Cowboys? Bills have a good shot this year out of the AFC. All right, good luck. But a lot of the so-called experts, though, Matthew, seem to be suggesting that, at least betting experts, seem to be suggesting that they would take the Niners plus the points. And we've got Tyson Miller is our uh, first autograph. Cubs, Adam Copperman with the Cubbies. Joe Adele will go to the Angels, Eric J. Mount Castle for the Orioles, it's for Emma. Austin Riley, Aqua Shimmer, 150 to 199. And a Cabrian Hayes rookie card for the Pirates. That'll be for Brian Crouch. Nick T has the World Champs, the Braves. And the autograph is uh, Tajay Anton for James Port and the Cincinnati Redlegs.
Some solid rookie cards there. Next box. Yeah, Micah Parsons is pretty good. You know, and guys like, uh, you know, Diggs can can just change the game at the, at a moment's notice. One, uh, you know, one, one misthrown pass by Jimmy Garoppolo. Pick six all of a sudden. I think that's going to be a good game. It was, what's crazy is... All these games are rematches except for the Niners and Dallas. So my Raiders playing the Bengals. That's a rematch. New England has played Buffalo twice already. Philadelphia's in Tampa Bay. They played earlier this season. Niners, uh, Niners Cowboys have not played each other. That's a classic like 90s lineup too. Uh, Steelers, Chiefs, they played against each other earlier this season. And of course, Arizona and uh, the Rams are divisional rivals, so they've already played each other twice. A lot of interesting things to think about. You know, the, I'd, like to, I'd like to think that the teams that lost the previous matchup, you know, will work to make adjustments. You know, we'll, uh, you know, will the Raiders, they, they got blown out by Cincinnati, but if you look at the game stats, that game was actually a little bit closer than you thought. I think a couple of bad turnovers towards the end kind of made the scoreline look a little more, more rough than it actually was. Twenty-eight out of three ninety-nine. Ryan Yarbrough for the Rays. Adam. So it'll be it'll be interesting to see. I think the Patriots Buffalo Bills. It's a three ninety-nine. Adam. I think the Patriots last last time out. They uh, they lost to the Bills. What kind of adjustments have they made? And our autograph is for the Cardinals. That is Roel Ramirez. <laughs> That's right. It's true. Maybe not until this weekend. No one, no one since 1991 has been able to text. I guess no one's been able to text Bengals won a playoff game. Texting wasn't around until long after the Bengals' first playoff win. That, that's crazy to think about. What do they do back then? Are you, I guess, you're call, calling people, right? If you're, if you're watching the game, if you're watching the game, and the Bengals won, let's say you're watching different houses, I guess you're just, you're calling someone on a landline. So what, you, you go from the living room and you run to the kitchen you take take the phone and there's like the 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 the, the curly Q coiled uh, cord. Nice Pete Alonzo relic. And you you're dragging that across through the kitchen to the living room, watching post game celebration, talking to your friends. And what if someone else called you? Put someone on hold, call waiting, if you have call waiting. Let me click over. All right, Bob's on the other line. Hang on, Frank. And a blue auto, Blake Taylor, Houston Astros, Jeremy Port. 105 out of 150. Uh, 
All right, box two. Rex, well, oh, you were, uh, Rex, you were listening on IG, listening to Jason, when I started cutting in during the break. Oh, you upgraded to YouTube Premium. You still had YouTube on the background. We were, we, so, it'd be, you were hearing me and Jason at the same time. I'd be like, uh, that'd be, that, you could imagine that, Rex, as you working at the store. That's what it would sound like if you worked at the shop. Was it Boomer Esiason the last last time that what they won it all? Is that late eighties? Did they win it all? Were those the Icky Woods years? Or just last playoff win ever? Maybe Boomer Esiason era? I thought they won, didn't they win one with Carson Palmer? I said if you worked at the store, Rex, I, we would never hire you. Never. That, that would just save us the trouble of firing you. We've got an Eduardo Escobar Green, 57 out of 99 for Arizona. Adam with the Diamondbacks and a Refractor Alec Baum for the Phillies. Mike Krasinski with that. No, no Kitna, no Palmer. They always got upset round one. I guess so. So maybe it was Boomer Esiason in last playoff win for the Bengals. And an orange crone zone. Jay Cronenworth, Brian Crouch, and the Padres. 11 out of 25. And we got a pink Marco Gonzalez, 121 out of 350, speckle for the Mariners. And that's going to be for Ryan Harold, who's looking for some Kalinex. Sixel Sanchez goes to Nick L. and the Fish. And a Refractor Otani, your MVP, going to Eric J. All right, final box coming up. And last time, I think the Raiders' last playoff appearance was 2016. And I think that's where... That's where uh, in the last 
Raiders had clinched a playoff spot a couple games early. And I think the next game afterwards, Derek Carr, like, broke his leg or something. And so the Raiders lost to the Texans, I think, with a backup QB. Mike Glennon, maybe? No, not Mike Glennon. Maybe it was Mike Glennon. Or maybe it was the quarterback from Michigan State from 2016. I don't know. They didn't win. And I think the, the last win before that must have been the AFC Championship game in the early 2000s to get to that Super Bowl where they got smoked by the Buccaneers. Maybe Raiders Buccaneers would uh, would be my playoff, my Super Bowl hope this year. You know, that would, that would be great. Little 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 revenge game right there would be awesome. I know, Ryan. We we got to turn this luck around at some point. I know you're getting your ABs in, but but this is this is like some sort of this is like a Chris Davis Orioles kind of slump here. We gotta we gotta turn this around with a. You know, I would even take a, a good grouping of, 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 of just hits, you know. Yeah, I have been, Ryan. I have been. All right, there's the Crone Zone again. And for the Mariners, we've got, maybe this is a start, Johan Ramirez, rookie autograph for Ryan and the Mariners. Maybe some, maybe some singles. Maybe that paves the way to a home run. I don't know. Uh, at least it's something better than nothing. These are that that's like a that's like a, a a bloop single. You know, it's nothing it's nothing sexy, but you just you just kind of kind of got jammed up. All right, kind of kind of went whoop, <laughs> kind of did one of those and got an autograph. That's where that's that's where it starts. I hope. John Lester, 43 out of 99. Green Wave autograph just retired. Brian Hayes' rookie card goes to Brian Crouch. And there's his teammate, Jared Oliva. Pirates autograph for Brian Crouch. There you go. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. And that was a four-box break. This is Kyle Lewis. This is not his rookie year. It's a four-box break of 2021 Topps Chrome Baseball. What is this? And a, maybe a variation right here. Tony Gonsolin for Jeffrey and my Dodgers. All right. Now, this is a uh, wax party break. Ch chance to win some, uh, some nice boxes. Top two from this group right here. Adam down to Kevin and everyone in between. New dice, new list. And let's roll it, randomize it. Six and a one, seven times. Top two after seven. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. Drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. From three on down. Oof, very close, Adam. No cigar here. But there are plenty of opportunities for now. We just started this promo, so a lot of opportunities to try to get in. Top two, you're in. Nick, Neil, congrats to you. You are in that Wax Party promo. Check out the list of boxes that we're giving away. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one.